yoga. Ever I use kind of like halfway in there a little bit. Doing all right? Yeah, I'm doing good. Good. Don't be sounding all controlling and stuff. Nah. I ain't in trouble. I just know what I see. You said what? I said you invited me here. I know. I know. I just want everybody to see your face and everything. And dude, where you been at, bro? Well, I've been uh, grinding, working, doing YouTube. You know how it is. All right. We're going to get to it, though. We're going to get to it. All right. Uh, why, why you feel like the average women don't like average men? I don't feel like the average woman don't like average men. Okay, why you feel that way? Because I feel like I'm an average woman and I like average men. Okay. But what's average? And the guy that's making about fifty thousand, fifty five, sixty thousand a year on average. If like, I'm making the same thing, so that's that we at a hundred. That ain't. But I'm saying the majority. I'm saying those. I can't speak for the majority. I think they. I mean they. I would assume they entitled. Mm -hmm. Right. Because, I mean, we ain't, I'm talking about you specifically, but I'm saying in general, most women saying they want a man making 200, 300,000, which is cool. That's their preference, but that just leaves a gap for like the average man, you know, that is going to be, that they, going to be a lot of single men, or whatever the case may be, uh, because right. women got, you know, unrealistic expectations. See what I'm saying? Yeah, but I can't speak for those women because that's not me. I can't. Right. I feel it. Yeah, I, I feel it. I feel it. For the gold diggers, I can't speak for the women that go after men so they can get a new handbag. I can't speak for the women that go after the men just so they can get their hair done and nails it. done and, and take flights. And I can't speak for those. So I if you it. Can speak for the women that's like me, <clears throat> I can speak. I feel it. I feel it. Just ask a question though. I mean, yeah. Y'all better, better. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Focus, focus on me. Focus on me. Focus on me for me. Um, I feel it. I feel it. Why, why you think so many men are like um sexless right now? They sexless. Sexless. Yeah, sexless. Celibate. Sexless. No, oh. celibate when you choosing not to have sex. They're sexless by because women don't want to have sex with them right now. I don't know. I didn't know that was a. What? What are these statistics coming from? What are these numbers coming? Oh from? man, it's, it's, it's all over the place. Um, I can pull them up. Like this generation of men is more sexless than ever. We ain't never seen a generation of men that's more sexless than ever right now. Um, so you saying yeah. that men can't get no, no uh? It's a lot. Oh, of yeah, done. yeah. There's a but lot not, of sexless men. Maybe they. Yay, they probably just like it. Nah. <laughs> well, you should have put me out here. <clears throat> no, I'm just asking the question, though. I'm just asking the question, fam. We do. I mean, you say you feel like because they're nope. gay. No, I mean, I don't know. Maybe they, I don't know. I didn't know men were sexless. <laughs> okay. Okay. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. We got Right now, we got more guy versions than female versions. Guy versions of what? We have guy versions. We have more guy versions than female version. I'm saying. Oh, okay. That was a question. That was a statement. No, that was, I mean, that was a statement. I was saying we got more guy versions than the female version. That's what I'm saying, though. No, I'm asking. I was asking, like, why you think that is, though? What? Why we got more men sexless and more women having more sex? I don't know, because that's the social norms that I, that's being presented is to have sex, I guess. Okay, cool, cool. Okay, fair, fair. Do you feel like uh, a toxic mother is just as bad as an uh, absent father? Yeah, I think everyone feels that way. Fair, fair. Why? Why you think a lot of, especially in the black community, women look at guys that work like regular jobs, like you know, nine to five, is squares, lanes, or dusties? I guys, for those type of women that look at men like that, because that's not how I look at men like that. That work a regular nine to five. I ain't talking about you. I'm just saying the majority uh, look at. Uh, once again, they're entitled. They feel like they're entitled. They're gold diggers. 
the internet, they they mama probably was. <laughs> I can't do this. I would be too honest for this. I would have get banned and blocked. No. They mama no, you probably was some freak, some you know, some net, some some prostitutes, and that's all they seen. I guess I don't, I don't know. Right, right. Okay, cool. Facts, facts, facts. Do you feel like most women lose good men because of bad advice from their toxic, jealous, and lonely friends? True or false? Uh, no. Okay. You turn your, you turn your music down for me? I'm going to get off here because I don't like my stuff being controlled. You didn't. You supposed to send me a list of instructions. <laughs> no, I was. You, you want to turn your music down for me? If that's okay. My music. I actually turned it down. Yeah, I, I mean, I feel like I could hear it in the background. But um, as I was saying, <laughs> who who you feel like is responsible to guide like uh children, the teachers or the parents? They parents. Man. I feel you feel like this generation of parents is guiding their they kids? No. No. Not the Gen Z generation. I think this is the right generation, right? Yeah. It's like, yeah. yeah no. What do you think they missing? Guiding from their own parents. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, what's the uh, most effective way to pay off debt, you think? Uh, don't have none. I feel, I feel. Why do people cheat in happy relationships? I don't think people cheat in happy relationships. Okay. okay. You ain't never cheated before? No. no. Did you ever get cheated on? Mm -hmm. How did you find out you was getting cheated on? Um, I went looking for it. You went through his phone? Indeed. Okay. You know what they say? If you find what you uh find some, you looking for something you ain't supposed to find, you're gonna find something you ain't want. Yeah, I was just young then. You can't pay me to go through nobody's phone now. Right. You think that's a that's an insecurity if you gotta go through your uh, somebody's phone? Yes. Trust issues, insecure. Do you think like if somebody dates, should they call each other partners or significant other significant others? Like you think those are appropriate terms to call somebody you you uh in a relationship with? Yeah, why not? Well, I, I would say it actually came from the gay community. You know, them terms like significant others or partner. It's so, still re relevant. Okay. Okay. Cool. Cool. Most heterosexual people. It's still relevant. Well, why you feel like men don't leave when they're unhappy? Why men don't leave on uh, toxic relationships when they're unhappy? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Because they're comfortable. It's the same reason for why women probably wouldn't leave when they're unhappy. Because they're comfortable. If you have opportunity to fix one problem in the world, what would it be? Um... Child abuse. Do you feel like anybody that forgives cheating is cheating too? No. You feel like cheating is part of ups and downs? No. It's a choice. Between your husband and dad, who will sit in the front seat? Well, my dad's dead, so my husband. If a guy said he had between, if a guy had to choose between you or his mother, who you feel like should sit in the front seat? What you say? If a guy had to choose between you or his mother, who you feel like should sit in the front seat? I let his mama sit in the front seat because I'm nice. Okay. Have you ever lied in the job interview and what did you lie about? Uh, experience. It's me, okay. Facts, facts. You said what? I'm talking to them. 
You, you focus on me. I, I, need, I need your undivided attention if that's okay. You ain't finna get my undivided attention. You know. <laughs> you already know rub me the wrong I need you to be serious with me. I need you to be serious with me. I need you to rock with me. Serious with you. I'm gonna get back over here, though. No! Okay.